One of the fastest growing segments of the shooting sports the last few years has been long distance shooting and hunting. And here at Swarovski Optic, we've tried to develop some products to really help the shooter make those long distances. And we've seen a huge increase the last few years in the amount of ballistic reticles that are out there. But what we found here at Swarovski is it's really been a huge advantage to customize your specific load to the rifle and the scope as well. And with our new custom BT, you can do just that. It allows you to call into our customer service department and give us all your specific bullet information. Whether you're using a factory load or you're hand loading, we're able to take all that info and design a custom turret that has your specific sight and distances and the downrange distances you want programmed onto the turret itself. So once you decided that the custom ballistic turret is right for you, we make it really easy. Once you receive the part from customer service, all you really need to do is go to your ballistic turret scope and disassemble it like you normally would if you were gonna sight it in with the BT. The cover comes off and all the rings come off and then even the bottom coupling will pop off. And at this point, you're ready to mount the scope on the rifle and go sight it in. This particular rifle that we're going to be using today is a 300 Winchester Magnum and we're going to use a 200 yard zero. So now that we're sighting at 200 yards, the next step in the process is to lock that ballistic turret in place. And what you want to do is just take this locking mechanism and set it back to where your zero setting is. And then take your ballistic coupling and drop it back on the BT scope and this will set your zero distance at 200 yards. Once you've locked the coupling in place, the next step in the process is to take your custom BT. And one of the really nice features about the BT is the fact that the information that you supplied to customer service as far as rifle scope you would be using and bullet information will be engraved on the edge of the custom turret. So if you're using this scope on another rifle with another caliber, you're able to tell them apart. But you want to take the custom turret, drop it right down on the threads and match up your 200 yard zero with the zero setting on the scope. We've got everything assembled back together the way that it should be, but what I like to do is take one more shot at that 200 yard zero just to make sure the gun is shooting where it's supposed to. So now that we know the turret is fully assembled and shooting dead on at 200 yards, the first downrange distance we're gonna to try today is 300 yards. So all we really need to do is take our turret, adjust it to that 300 yard setting, and it should be right on. So now we know the gun's on at 300 yards. The next downrange distance we're gonna move, we're gonna move right to 600 yards. And all we need to do with the ballistic turret is crank it up to that 600 yard setting. And we should be dead on at 600 yards. So in less than an hour, we've got this gun shooting consistently out to 600 yards. We're able to come set up the whole system, sight it in and zero it at 200 yards, shoot consistently at 300 and way out to 600. And that's the beauty of the system, to put all this equipment together and mesh it into one and make it a much simpler way to make long distance shots. And you know, that's the nice thing for me. You get to the range, you're able to do this and it, it just, it makes your time at the range much more productive and it's going to make you a better hunter out in the field.